Hey guys, so today I wanted to share with you guys a haul. Um, most of it is from Big Lots, only I think two items are from Michaels. And I'm gonna get started then. Um, I bought this, it's called the Visual Journal. Uh, let me get my camera situated. Um, it's for art journal journaling, and I bought it actually for my sister, who today she turned, um, turned 15. Happy birthday, Lily! Um, all of us, actually there's four sisters and I have one brother, and all of us had a quinceañera, so yeah, we're Mexican, and she didn't want one because she's, she's not girly at all, and she like hates anything to do with that kind of stuff. I mean, she doesn't hate the tradition, but she just, it's not her thing, so she really did not want a big deal out of her party, and so she's just gonna go to the movies with her friends and have a game night and pizza, and that's all she wanted, so, um, I actually already got her something I got her a camera um, just a picture slash camcorder it's really cool actually but um, I got it to her a while back so like about a month ago and so it feels weird not giving her anything so I bought her this art journal it was $7.99 at oh well by the time she sees this it'll be past her birthday I don't think she'll care it was $7.99 at um, Michael's and I really hope that she uses it because it's it's like her kind of thing that she would do too and uh, I I named it I write really ugly but she can rip out the first page if she doesn't like it but I just wrote something on the first page and and then named it for her so anyway so I and they have a lot of they they kind of got like a new section at least at my Michaels for art journaling and they didn't used to have anything and they actually have like glimmer mists and stuff that aren't your usual like tattered angels or you know, or the smooch or anything like that. They're, they're different types, so I'm going to be checking out that section because I, either I hadn't gone to that section, but I'm pretty sure it's new because I'm usually all over that store. But it was $7.99, and it's really cool if you guys want to check that out. <clears throat> and then I also got her this um, Recollections, Recollections, whatever, however you say it, um, trimmer. And she, I let her borrow mine a while back. And... I don't really care for that one, the one that she has really, it, it's like the Cricut one, but I don't like it that much and I actually use my other, I, I think it's, fit. Um, I don't know, it's another trimmer that I have, a little one like this one, so I got her this one instead so that it'll be easier for her, because I don't think the other one, I don't think she likes it either, and so I had let her borrow it, but then I wrote a little note back here, <laughs> it says, this means I want mine back, but not really, I don't really care. And I also wanted to share with you guys that it was $6.99 on clearance, so if you guys want to check it out. And I think the original price was $15, so it's really cool. So, yeah. Ugh, she's going to see this video and she's going to be like, ugh, you got me cheap stuff. But it doesn't matter because it's still really good, the quality. And I'm getting her some other things to go with it, too, but... Anyway, sorry, I'm like trying to get everything out. So, the biggest part of my haul was for um, Big Lots. <laughs> and for some reason, I've noticed Michael's is always next to Big Lots. I don't know if that's true everywhere, but I know um, where I live and then where I used to go to school. You know, that's in, where I used to go to school is in Sherlock, California, because I, I used to go to Stanislaus. Um, <clears throat> the Michael's was right next to Big Lots, and so it is where I live too. Anyway, so I also wanted to share with you guys all these stamps that I got, and they were all $2, and these would at least be $6.99 regular price, and that would be, like, probably clearance price, because I know they go for, like, $5.99 when they hit the first clearance mark at Michael's. So, um, I got this stamp here. I really like it. I think I had seen it at Michael's before, and I actually wanted to get it, but it was, like, $12.99, and I was not about to pay that much money. Mostly because I'm not rich. I'm very limited on my budget and so I always just buy clearance or things with my coupons. I never ever ever buy full price unless I really want something and I need it right away but most of the time I can wait. <clears throat> Another thing that I, the other, well I'm just going to go through all the stamps. They were all $2 so the one that pa passed was $2 and then this one was also $2 and it's for like a little boy. See it says it's a boy. And I really, when I saw this, I knew I had to get it because I have a a girl, a girl's um, set of this, but 
I don't I didn't have anything really for boys and since most of the time um, most people all the little babies in my family or my friends they've been having pure girls and then lately I know two are having a boy and so I, I was really looking forward to this oh and that's my phone I think I'm gonna have to pause it hold on Okay, sorry about that. Um, yeah, it was my phone. I'm, I actually take care of my knees right now in the summertime since I'm jobless and <laughs> and she's around the same age as my daughter and they have a boss. Like, most of the time her mom comes and picks her up and she doesn't want to go home. <laughs> so, um, that was her mom just seeing if, if, I, if we were here so she can pick her up. Anyway, like I was saying, I didn't really have a boy, a little baby, like, boy one, so... I was really excited about this one, and I do have two friends that are having a boy, so really cool. And then this one here, it's really cute. Um, it has like the tickets, the admit one, and then it has um, let's do, and then it has like a checklist, coffee or lunch or shopping or whatever. Um, it has really cool things that you could use for like journaling or anything like that. So for your cards, mini, mini album, sorry can't talk today and then so yeah these are all really cool for two dollars and then this one here is the alphabet but they're kind of like in a little frame which I really like because if, you, if you're gonna make like a, a card for someone you can put their initial on there I don't know I thought that was really cool and it was two dollars too and it has 36 stamps in it so I'm guessing it has the 26 letters of the alphabet and 10 you know numbers yeah it probably has up to 10 in the numbers Okay, and then this one's another boy one that I found, and it's actually cool because I have a girl one that has a stroller, and then this one's more like for the boys. See, it says chicks dig me, and then uh, that looks cute, the little mommy one, and then baby face, and then this one here made me laugh. Poo happens. Poop. <laughs> Instead of using the other word. <laughs> and then the baby boy, and cool kid, and hi, I'm new here. I thought those were really cute for a boy so yeah and then these the footlongs I really like them too they're like awesome but they're kind of hard to store if you like if I have them in my binder so what I've been doing with those ones I don't think I have it here but I put it in the CD case I'm, I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about a lot of people do that so I just place them in the CD case for the footlongs because they don't fit in my in my um binders that I have and I really like this frame that was like the reason that I bought it mostly I mean I would have bought it anyway because it was two dollars but I was really excited about that one and then here I have another one it's another foot long one it says friends and then thanks for being you lots of lo laughs dream thank you and then the frame and happy birthday I love you thinking of you hugs I really like the hugs one that one's cute and it has a it has a lot of phrases in there and I like that and then I think I'm gonna leave my two favorite ones till the end but all of these are awesome but actually all the ones that are coming up are actually really cool I think I went through the ugly ones first <laughs> and they're not even ugly okay and then this one here it's I don't know what the it's rough I am not gonna say right the Garens inspiration I don't know sandy lion sticker designs but you guys can see the two dollar sticker on there and I, I thought this was cute because it's like a teacher a school oriented type stamp set and that's a chalkboard and it says I love school and then a plus super kid it has puzzle pieces and this belongs to little quotation bubbles so I thought that one was a cute set for school and we're actually halfway through the summer. That's so scary. <laughs> and then, um, this one I thought was just the coolest thing. My birthday's in October, and October is my favorite month. Not only because of my birthday, but, um, Halloween is my favorite, favorite holiday. I don't even like Christmas as much as Halloween. So, it has really cute Halloween stamps. And I don't have a Halloween stamp. It's just kind of surprising. <laughs> but, yeah. I don't really have a lot. I mean, this is like, it's not going to double my collection, but I mean, I have more than this, but I still I don't have a lot of stamps. I really love that skull and being, you know, Mexican, El Dia de los Muertos. 
it's not really about the skulls though it's more about honoring your dead and but on Halloween my family we do the Halloween we go around trick-or-treat and give out candy and then come into the house and have a little party and then um, usually since we have little kids we just make them trick-or-treat um, we go trick-or-treat outside so that they know you know they get it the holiday spirit but then since they're little we only take them like around the block and then we have um, each adult stand in each door and then my battery dying out. Anyway, and they trick or treat around the inside of the house. And one of the doors is set up for El Dia de los Muertos. And my parents talk to them about, um, you know, the tradition. And even though we don't really do a lot here except that. and But they talk about everything and why the tradition is. Which is really cool. I like that. But yeah, this is my Halloween one. And if my battery stops, I'll have to do another little clip here. And then this one here, it's a really cool journaling one. I love the little frames and it says, thank you, thinking of you, happy birthday, and then the you're invited. And yep, I hate this battery, it always runs out. I should probably get another one. Okay, and then this one here I thought would be awesome to like stamp as a background or a watermark, especially the big one there. And this one has four. Okay guys, so this one's the one we were just talking about, and it has four pieces, and I'm really looking forward to using it. I really, really like this one here. Okay, and then this following one is kind of like one of the ones I already showed you guys. See, it's, this one says congrats, and then it has a list on your new job, on your new home, on your new love life, on the new you, and then on stain 29. <laughs> I like the Stain 29 one, I think it's funny. And it also has some more um, ticket stamps. So, good for a kiss anytime. And then I owe you. And it has this little um, tag type stamp to from, and then another ticket. And then this one, you and me. Let's catch up. And then it has like coffee or tea, chat time, dinner and drinks, movie night. So it's cute. And then um, these two following ones I'm really excited about. Especially, I think that one's really cute, that stamp. And the face just like comes out out of nowhere. <laughs> I like that. And it has hearts and the heart on the wings. It kind of makes me think of Tim Holtz for some reason. Which is probably what they were trying to do. <laughs> Anyway, but I think these are really cute. And then the last one's my favorite one. And it's only because of one stamp in there. And then it says yourself. Thank you. And the little face. Leave the heart. And then dreams really do come true. And then the dress. That's my favorite one in there. I can't wait to use that one. So cute. And then it has a little glass slipper, I suppose. But it's really, really cute. That that stamp right there is my favorite one. So I bought 14 stamp sets, and they were $2 each. So That would have been, like, just what I would have paid for two if I would have paid a regular price. I mean, for three. Around three, because with taxes and everything. So yay. Yay me. <laughs> so anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the... The little haul. I know I stopped it like three times and then this last part was just a different day. So I probably sound different. <laughs> but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys have a big lots near you, go and check it out. I don't know. They might have some. I know. I think I had seen. I'm actually not sure. But I think I had seen like a haul on YouTube that mentioned something about big lots. And then I didn't actually. I don't think I watched it all or anything. But um. I ended up, when I was driving by, I was like, huh, I should go check. I think I, I heard someone saying Big Lots had, like, good things right now. So I went in there, and I found a whole bunch of stamps. I couldn't believe it. I just, like, kept on looking through all of them and making sure I had all the ones they offered. I actually didn't bring home, like, two of them that um I didn't think I really would use, and I didn't want to, like, waste way more than I was supposed to because I was already doing that. And then also... um they have like the little stamps they actually have the dollar stamps 
in there, but they have a mark that's two dollars, which makes me think that any stamp that they get in there, they mark it two dollars, and they don't even know, you know, what the retail value of it is, or they don't care because those little stamps, like the ones, um, like Studio G and sorts that they have in there, they have at Joann's and Michaels for one dollar, but then you go in there and it's supposed to be cheaper, but it actually has it a two dollar sticker which kind of made me laugh but um i was actually tempted to buy two of them because they were super cute but i didn't because i knew like just try to find them somewhere else cheaper um so yeah so go check out your big clubs guys and thanks for watching bye